you. It's great to be back and yet again. Thank you, Akon Staffers, for bringing me all the way back out to my home, my hometown, my home con, Akon. We're gonna have some fun tonight. We got, of course, lovely skits. We have walk-ons. We have entertainment for you, ladies and gentlemen. We got prize. What? Dance, monkey dance. I know. That'll be five hundred dollars. <laughs> I kid, I kid, I joke with you. But okay, we can't do the cosplay without the judges, correct? We need judges, and we have judges. Yeah. I now introduce the judges. Judge number one is Evan Winkler, cosplay staff head and president of Radio Comics. There she is right there. Next there is Caroline Clavel, cosplay lieutenant and theater costume major. Well, no, yeah. Very nice, very nice. Next is Max Kirkland, filmmaker and king of props. Then there's Anna Aesthetic, premier cosplayer and fashion maven. Fantastic. All right, that's everyone, right? We're good, we're good, we're good to go. Are we ready for a cosplay? <laughs> Excellent, all right. I'm gonna go over here, I feel like I have to teach you now. So I'm standing in a nectar. Let's start with a walk-off, shall we? <laughs> walk-off number one is Kristen, Alexis, Kai, and Melissa of Segoy Anime Club at the University of Arkansas. Walk-on number two, thanks to some new friends and the power of hope, the Pretty Cures are given a new power which enables them to defeat Shadow in the Mirror Kingdom. <laughs> this is Carolyn and Michelle from Yes, Pretty Cure 5, the movie, The Mirror Kingdom's Miraculous Adventure. Walk on number three. All this guy has to do for a fan base is crash helicopters and get his butt kicked. Yeah. Sparrow and Cardinalca. Walk on number nine. 
Fine. Sorry. 109 centuries before the word was invented, the kings and queens of England were cosplay. Presenting Her Majesty as the kidnapped goddess of spring, Persephone, the captive queen of winter. Interpretation of ancient Greek mythology. <laughs> Thank you very much, Tiger, Phyllis, and Amanda. Walk on. Number. Wait for it. Walk on number 10. On a Wednesday, is cosplaying Suki the Kyoshi Warrior from Avatar. confused with that film from M. Night Shyamalan Ding Kong. I now walk on number 11. Things go to an Emmy, 10 heads to an Emmy, in gallops at over 150 miles per hour. It's me. Tonight we'll be showing the sad, sad fate that some of this world carries, brought to you by the Black Diablos Cosplay Group. Welcome to the circus! The Wood Circus from Pokeloid! Next up, walk on number 13, the woman who has no heart, Kagura the Free Wind, from Inuyasha. <laughs> Next in our walk on category number 14, Michael as Puppet Master Kankuro and Autumn as his Puppet Pro. Thank you very much, Beth. 
company, Batman, will be very impressed. No, 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 no. Walk on number 17, the red-headed sixth squad lieutenant of the Go Tie 13, Renji Amara. Six dick the sword. Walk on number 18. Miss Belial Pride is Emperor Mateus of Final Fantasy Dissidia. Walk on number 20. Keela cosplaying as Maylene from Black Butler. Walk on number 21. He is an autonomous robotic organism from the planet Cybertron. Walk on category number 22. This guy always wanted to have a giant robot for his own. 